say that. Oh, yeah, yeah. I won't just say yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Need you to do more than say that. Fulton County District Attorney Fonnie Willis uh, can stay on and prosecute the 2020 Georgia election racketeering case against uh, Donald Trump and 14 of his co-defendants. It was ruled today by Judge Scott McAfee, but only if she removed special prosecutor Nathan Wade, which she didn't have to. He stepped down. So that that has been settled. We are uh, back on the case. Wink, wink. And all of that, Roderick. Thoughts and prayers. Uh, first of all, that song. Um, <laughs> I feel like oh. I have to play that at the same time that I play uh, the uh, "She Took My Draw" song. I oh, feel like I, I feel like that, that's a good companion. You, yeah, you can put them back to back in your play on your playlist. Yeah, come on, they got to um, on the side. Yeah, no, I like it. <laughs> yeah. it's got it it's got it's got a little ring to it. I never mm-hmm. knew what the um, the law was going to say. You know, I won't even pretend to be like a legal expert here um, because I feel like a lot of people play legal expert with this. And I was like, I don't yes. know. It's entertaining. It's giving me Shonda Rhimes. Do I know the real implications? People was like, it's embarrassing. She going to lose the case, all this stuff. I mean, I feel like this is the best case scenario. He's gone. She is not off the case. Everything we get back to the business of the people, and we prosecute this election fraud, and uh, you know, no harm, no foul. Is, uh, yeah. So I'm, I'm cool. I'm cool with everything that happened. This is the. I, I don't know why it took so long. I feel like I knew this. The two days of 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 testimony I watched, I said they don't got nothing. So what what's the problem? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like none of this guy. Like I thought y'all was gonna have some receipts or something. This is a lot of speculation. So. I'm glad well, it wasn't judge. speculation. It was a lot of snitching going yeah. on by the people close to both of them, both yeah. BOF. Yeah, no, it was, it was, this was a soap opera. As yeah. if we could, as if we needed distractions at this point, uh, a lot of it could have been avo- avoided. The behavior mm-hmm. of both of them, Fawny Willis and Nathan Wade, could have been better. They yeah. they could have considered us <laughs> in, in their situation or waited. You could wait. Yeah. Just wait. Do like yeah, Sharon I, I, Russell. Wait a year. Yeah, I feel like when I say speculation, I'm just talking about the like, oh, the, the, he's getting this case because the money was did it. It's like, right. Okay, right. where's the receipts? What, right. what y'all talking about? Where's the who? Where's the evidence that the money was have? And they just didn't seem to have anything. So it was just a big ass waste of time. But that's what Trump people do. They delay, delay, delay. They trying to just run four quarters offense and hope they can get this to Trump getting in office. And then go, well, he's the president. How can you prosecute a sitting president? I guess we got to let him go. So uh, I think that's what they're waiting on. But I'm glad it didn't work out for him this time. Yeah. I, and, you know, oh, the only problem is now this this case was supposed to, I think, start in uh, like April, mm-hmm. <laughs> you know, which means we'd be probably having a conviction in June, July, August, leading up to, uh, you know, <sighs> I don't know. Well, I'm just going to wait and see because even the legal experts don't know. Apparently a lot, mm. a lot of people out there, not expert just because you have a law degree, just because you're on, on a, on a cable outlet.